here last night I had a or well, yesterday evening I had a doe at 40 yards I think last night I told myself I was going to eat eight inches high so let's say eight inches high Oh, what a missed. Left and right's pretty good though. So 40 yards, I'm getting over a two foot drop, shooting 225 feet per second. That's good to know. Let me see where that would have been if I'd have put the. Maybe these reticles are closer than I thought. I believe that worked if I'd have used my reticles. We'll try that. I'm going to do a 35. Uh, I might just go 30, 35, and 40. See what I got. See if he's, how these reticles hold up. I've sighted in dead on for 20. Oh, that's not too bad. A little bit high. All right, let's try 35 and 40. Okay, this is 35. Using the 35 reticle. Still not too bad. On the target, uh, I think it's closer than the knock looks because this arrow is coming back down at an angle. All right, let's try 40. Everything's a little bit high. Let me go back to 20, maybe. See what that's doing. But this is, the broadhead may hit a little lower. Maybe it'll hit it a little farther right or something. But my left and right's really good. Interesting. Okay, now we're at uh, 25. Oh, that's on. I shot it with the 20-yard uh, reticle. So the 25 is dead on. Yeah, because when I put the reticle on the yellow tape, it uh, it's on the arrow. The 25 reticle is on the arrow. All right, let's go 20. Bingo. That might be even a little high. All right, let's try 15 and 10. Okay, here's 15. Aiming with the 20 yard crosshairs. So just about inch and a half high. All right, let's go to 10. You want to know this for small game, especially. Okay, this is 10 yards. I'm aiming with the 20 yard reticle. About the same as 15, about an inch and a half. Well, there you go. And I'd say five yards is dead on because it's actually crossing the line of sight. The arrow is and then coming back down. Okay, I dropped it four clicks. Let's see what we got. 30 yards. Elevation's perfect.